what's up guys it's Lexa here I'm in my kitchen in my underwear and I wanted to give you some tips on um, ways to improve your wrapping and ways to be able to wrap faster yeah one second I need to stir my spaghetti and then I'm suddenly not hungry anymore. Anyways, I wanted to like give you a few tips on how to like wrap really fast and improve wrapping and improve your performance because um, I don't know, I see a lot of really like crappy, iffy performances where like these dudes aren't even saying any of their words. They're just standing on stage like, hey, and like jumping around. Music is playing in the back of them and they have like 50 hype men on stage or to like trying to wrap their wraps for them, but even they're getting out of breath. So it's like just really... I'm referring to Little Yachty, yes. Okay, so anyway, um, yeah, so what you want to do is fuck trying to look skinny, okay? Obviously, that's not an issue for a lot of guys, but you want to keep your rib cage, rib cage open so you, like, can actually flex, flex your rib cage open. Flex your rib cage open. A lot of the time, breathe in from your butt, so feel that breath pressure like go down okay and then like when you're wrapping you want to like keep everything in the front of your face like you want to feel it like right here in your mask so like always like from with wrapping like the tip of your lips you want it to be like on the tip of your lips so it's coming out really really fast and like if you do these weird exercises they'll strengthen your tongue like, I remember I think it was like um an interview Twisto was doing and he was talking about like strengthening his tongue no, it might have been Tech 9. I'm not sure. Either way, so this is what I do, and I've been doing this for like two years. I don't know why I thought of this, what the fuck it means, I don't know, but I made up like a tongue twister that was really hard to say. I could barely say it at first, and then as my breathing got better and my placement got better, I was able to say it really fast. So I'm saying wanna runna, okay? So it's easier, you might think it's easier to say than it like might actually be but so you're gonna I'll give you an example all right so here we go and like you'll take a breath in there like it'll be a big breath if you get if it gets mixed up or like whatever like keep going like start over stop and start over eventually you'll be able to like get to 16 and keep going and you could do this over a beat like sometimes I use the trap remix of rap god sounds like really fast um so you can start over there if you can't continue going because it's like a brain you have to like also trick your brain too so I know this is like so fucking weird and random and like why why are you making this video and you want to feel that like in your face you don't want to have like any pressure anywhere else so like I feel my tongue working a lot, um, but then I have some, like, tongue twisters I wrote down, and, like, my vocal teacher, like, gave me, like, these, these, I don't, I don't know, phrases to say that you say using the front of your face, so, like, my mom made lemon jam, you want that in the front of your face, so, like, a lot of M's and we went to don't let anything fall back like sometimes you can you know if you're doing something with a particular phrasing but let everything go forward and with like rapping and singing it's a weird thing where you feel it going backwards sometimes like you're swallowing air but it's also going forward so it's like using the resonance of your of your face to do this so like here's some tongue twisters some of these are funny and I don't practice them a whole lot um, but Every once in a while when I get some free time, I practice them. Oh, shut off. Okay, good. How can a clam cram in a clean cream can? And, like, you can say it with, like, some sort of flow. How can a clam cram in a clean clean... <laughs> See, I can't even do it. How can a clam cram in a clean cream can? How can a clam cram in a clean cream can? How can a clam cram in a clean cream can? <laughs> to sit in solemn silence in a dull dark dock in a pestilential prison with a lifelong lock awaiting the cessation of a short shop shock from the cheap and chippy chopper on a big black block. So, and then you can gradually save them faster. And so, to sit in solemn silence in a dull dark dock in a pestilential prison with a lifelong lock awaiting the cessation of a short shop shock with a chippy chippy chopper. <laughs> See, I fucked up. From a cheap and chippy chopper on a big black block. And like, if you fuck up, keep going. Whatever. 
Picky people pick Peter Pan peanut butter, tis a peanut butter, picky people pick. This one is so fucking hard, I will never get it. Luke Luck likes lakes. Luke's duck likes likes lakes. Luke Luck licks lakes. Luke's duck likes lakes. Duck takes licks and lakes. Luke Luck likes. Luke Luck takes licks and lakes. Duck likes. So like with L's, like it's all tongue. But um, let me try that again. Luke Luck likes lakes. Luke's duck likes lakes. Luke Luck licks lakes. Luke's duck likes lakes. Duck takes licks and lakes. Luke Luck likes. Luke Luck takes licks and lakes. Duck likes. That was that's the hardest one. One one. Ru <laughs> One one was a racehorse. Two two was one two. One 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 race. Two two one one two. Did Dick Pickens prick his pinky pickling cheek cling pick pick? Did Dick Pickens prick his pinky pickling cheek cling peaches in an inch of pinch of, or framing his famed French bench potatoes? Did Dick Pickens prick his pinky pickling cheek cling peaches in an inch of pinch or framing his famed French bench potatoes? Yeah. If a good cook 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 cookies. If a good cook 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 cookies. If a good cook 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 cookies. Turn up. If a good cook 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 cookies. Bah. Blah. Freezy breezy made these three trees freeze. Freezy trees made these trees cheese freeze. That doesn't make any fucking sense. Trees don't grow tree cheese. Trees don't go trees. Trees don't grow cheese. Trees don't go. That's hard. Trees don't. Trees don't grow. Cheese. Trees don't grow cheese. Cheese don't grow cheese. Trees don't grow cheese. Trees don't grow cheese. Trees don't go. Trees don't grow cheese. Cheese. It's hard. It, but it trains your brain, and your brain will like pick up and just be like really on point with your delivery. Trees don't grow cheese. 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 Tree. Trees don't grow trees. Trees don't grow cheese. Trees don't grow cheese. Trees don't grow cheese. Trees don't grow cheese. I'm writing this one down. I actually typed it in here incorrectly because that's how messed up it is. Cool. So yeah, I might make another video with some more tips, but really helps you with your wrapping and, and everything like that, tongue twisters and isolating, you know, like isolating your breath, isolating it to a specific point in your face. I mean, it also helps with speaking. So like, I know speech pathologists would probably suggest doing this as well. And you can like train your body and train your brain to literally do things completely different. It takes a while, don't give up, but like, do it a little bit here and there and it will definitely help you. Um, it, it helps you be um, an eloquent speaker, I guess. I don't know. So anyways, these are some tips. Um, don't feel embarrassed to do them. Totally go for it. It's fun. All right. Thanks, guys. Help stick your tongue out when you hit high notes. Stick your tongue out. Not like actually when you're singing, though. But.